Pinterest is one of the top 10 most visited websites in the world. And when Ben Silverman, Paul Sciarra, and Evan Sharp had the idea, it was just a big, unimaginable dream. Ben Silverman was studying medicine and training to become a doctor when he realized this was not the career path that he wanted to take. So he switched to business where he would become a consultant and work on financial spreadsheets and reports. But again, he realized that he just wasn't enjoying himself. Silverman really wanted to build a product. So he picked up and he left to Silicon Valley where he would work for Google. But again, he was in the consulting position and he didn't enjoy himself. So he left again. But this time he learned his lesson and he went after his dream. He teamed up with his friend Paul Sciarra in New York and together they made an iPhone app called Tote which was for mobile shopping. The app flopped and they struggled to gain any money so they decided to pivot and focus in on something that they both loved doing, collecting things. They really believed that the things that you collected say so much about yourself. Then Silverman met an architect named Evan Sharp who quickly joined the team of trying to think of a platform of collecting things. They finally landed on collecting photos and in December 2009, they began working on Pinterest and released a beta version in 2010. It was a slow start and Silverman even hand wrote personal letters to the first 5,000 users, giving them his personal phone number and even having meetings with some of them to gauge their interest and feedback. They say the first 100 to 1,000 users on your platform are incredibly valuable and to take them really seriously. You see this done with Airbnb as with their first 100 to 1,000 users, they were going door to door trying to gauge their customer feedback. And after nine months, they still didn't have a breakthrough. They had about 10,000 users, but they were steadily growing and gaining momentum. And eventually the site grew and grew and tech blogs started to pick it up and write about it. And it was in 2011 when they really started to gain popularity because the iPhone app released. And today, 80% of Pinterest users are on a mobile device. And in that December of 2011, Pinterest became a top 10 social media platform with over 11 million people on their platform per week. And in its latest funding in 2017, Pinterest was valued at $12.3 billion. And in September of 2018, Pinterest announced that they have over 250 million monthly active users and the majority of growth is coming outside of the US. And that's how Pinterest got started. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe to me on YouTube and follow me on Instagram at Austin Daniel Petrie.